Attorneys for families of children murdered during the mass shooting at Robb Elementary are asking a judge to sanction the Texas Department of Public Safety. This motion for sanctions was filed after crime scene photos from inside the school were leaked to the Washington Post. KPRC2 investigator Robert Arnold reviewed the filing. He joins us live now from the newsroom with what action these families want to see taken. Robert? The photos were published as part of an article the Washington Post ran on the use of AR-15 rifles during mass shootings. The contention from the families of Robb Elementary victims is these photos were leaked while DPS continues to deny the release of other information related to this mass murder. For nearly a year, families of Robb Elementary victims have asked for the release of the Texas Rangers report on the mass shooting. The Rangers investigation is considered to be the most extensive work on these murders and the families have sought the information as part of an independent investigation into the police response the day of the murders. But DPS won't release it, saying it's part of an ongoing criminal investigation and therefore confidential. When Rob Elementary crime scene photos were leaked to the Washington Post, attorneys for the families filed a motion asking a judge to order DPS to identify the person or persons responsible for the leaked photos, make that person available for a deposition, overrule any exception DPS will use to prevent the release of that information, and order DPS to release the unredacted version of the Texas Rangers report. A judge has yet to rule on the motion. DPS officials did send us a statement this afternoon reading the department released no photos to the newspapers except released and leaked are two different words and when we asked DPS who had thought released the photos we were told no comment. Live in the newsroom Robert Arnold KPRC 2 News. All right.